Hi, I am Sai. In this video, I want to repair a burned out LED bulb. The first question is that, is there any need to try to make it right? A burned out device is normally thrown away and be replaced by something new. But look, there are some possibilities that we can make it right. In some cases, you have a very simple tool, like a screwdriver. If it fails, it doesn't have several different components, so there is no possibility to make it right very simply, because it has just three different parts, so you don't have several opportunities. What about the device like this? This LED bulb has several components. For example, it has a lens, a body, a holder, and inside it we have several LEDs separated and they are creating light together. We have a heat sink and electronic board, so there are so many opportunities to make it right. The strange reality is that the higher the complexity of your device, the more possibilities that you have to make it right. It's strange, isn't it? Look. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel to watch all other videos that I provide for you about fixing or adjusting different devices with this consideration that I try to show you the most important things, the most important reasons why the devices do not work. And of course, in this video, we start with basics, the understanding of why these devices don't work are very important. We can imagine any LED bulb as two different parts. One part is really power supply. It changes the AC power to DC that can be used by LEDs. The problems that are occurring in this part are not very common, so I do not cover them in this video. This part can be very sophisticated or very simple. I prefer to call it main board. On the other side, we have several LEDs connected together. Really, they are installed on a board. And as you can see in here, they are like a chain connected together in series. This part can be called LED board. The problem with this chain and this series circuit is that if just only one LED burned out, we have a gap in here and all LEDs go dark. What we do in this video to rescue your LED bulb is to solder the gap. Now all LEDs connected together and they can work for several years. Here's my dead LED bulb. It doesn't work, as you see. What I do to repair it is exactly following the things that I just told you. The most probable thing about it is that just one LED is burned out. So I try to disassemble it using a cutter. First, try to create a gap between the body and the lens. Then use that created gap to open the lens using a knife. And now look, the LEDs are in here. They are in the chain, as I told you, and you need to search for an LED with a black dot. I can spot it very easily, here it is. 
I first remove it. And then, to fill up the gap that it has created, I solder it. Put the ball on a whole area like this. A simple cup. And then, I solder the missing LED. Now the LEDs are working together in a chain because we filled up the gap. Cold enough, I bring back the lens to its place and let's test it. Nice. Now that I have rescued my first LED bulb, I want to rescue this one with the holder E14. I want to testify my method one more time. This is my second dead LED bulb. It doesn't work too. And again. I disassemble the lens using a cutting device like this, creating enough gap in between. But I use a knife to open it. And again. Searching for LED which is burned out. Look, here it is. A very clear black dot on it. And again, I completely remove it. And then Fill up the gap with solder. Now the chain is again connecting the LEDs into each other. So it must work. I put back the lens. Look. The mission accomplished, and now that we know about the basics of the circuit inside the LED bulb, we are able to find a key to make it right. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and testify this method for yourself. Leave your comments about your experience. Thanks for watching.